Hey fam, I'm Josh with eDesk Stories, your home for all the juiciest stories and the hottest tea. Today, the original poster wants to know, Am I wrong for reminding my ex I'm only responsible for our children and not all of his kids? My ex-husband, a 40-year-old man, and I, a 35-year-old woman, have two children together, aged 12 and 11. We divorced about 10 years ago now because I feel like he regressed as a husband and a father during my second pregnancy, and he was even worse when our younger son was born. He was acting like a high school or college kid or a single 20-something with no kids. He spent more time with friends than with us. His friends were also treating me more like his mom and expecting me to pick him up from their houses when they needed to get on with stuff. He fought for 50% custody of our kids which he wasn't given and for the first two or three years he had every other weekend and a two-week period during the summer with them as well as alternating holidays. He started being more involved and eventually he did get 50% custody. It was at that time I found out he got some woman pregnant and he realized with three kids he needed to get his act together. He ended up with full custody of his third child, then he met his wife. They have two more children together now. There are two kids in her life but I don't believe they're her biological children anyway, who she is also partially supporting. Those two kids don't live with them but apparently she or they pay for stuff for this child. X and I started getting along better but then his marriage was rocky. As his marriage worsened, he started treating me like a co-parent to all his kids. He'd bring his other children to custody exchanges and expecting interactions between me and his other children. Then it was requests to babysit for him and his wife, which I never did. Then it was comments about our boy's old clothes at my house being sent to his house for his other kids and how we needed to make sure they had adequate clothing. I told him there was no we in that and he said of course there is, we're co-parents. I said of our two, sure, but not his other kids. It was requests for me to have his children in my home or to take them out to eat with me and our kids. And finally, it has turned into back-to-school craziness. I bought supplies for the boys, and he told me I hadn't bought nearly enough for everyone. I was like, hold up, what's that supposed to mean? And he pointed out that what I bought wouldn't be possible to share evenly between all five children. I told him we don't have five children, we have two, the two I bought those for. I told him, I am responsible for our children, not his three others. I told him he has a wife, they share two of those children, the other is in their home, so it's up to them. He told me that I know they don't have a lot of money and I cut him off and told him that still didn't make his children my problem. He said I can't possibly take care of just two of them, not when we're co-parenting and all five kids live together 50% of the time. He said I should be a part of the community to help raise these kids and keeping my distance like I do is so dang cold. We have really strong feelings on this one. He's clearly trying to guilt her into taking care of his responsibilities. It makes us wonder if this is a pattern and was one of the reasons why they split in the first place. We'd bet it was. She has no obligation to parent any of his children aside from her own. People become exes for a reason. We'd love to hear your thoughts on this, so drop them in the comments. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more daily juicy stories.